Good morning, Year 4, and welcome to Thursday's lesson for our English. Today we are going to be looking at improving our writing skills. So, it is going to be an assessed piece of writing. So what I need you to do is take a look at the picture. Can you write a story about this picture? Okay, so as it says here, this is an assessed piece of work. So you have to try your best on your own and then ask a grown-up to help you to upload it to Purple Mash. So, it's an independent write, which means it's all by yourself, okay? Using the picture as a starting point, can you write a piece of text around it? Now, this is very similar to Ewick, okay? All I would like you to do is take a look at the picture, think about where it is in your story. Is it at the beginning? Is it at the middle? Or is it even at the end? Okay, I have said it could be either fiction or non-fiction. So if you're doing a non-fiction piece, it won't be about a story, but it could be about what lighthouses are, who these people are, okay? There are a couple of things for you to remember though. Those are full stops. Don't forget about our full stops. Capital letters. We've been through front of the verbials a couple of times. So if you can, try to include those. And importantly, if you're doing a story, you need to remember that you are putting in paragraphs. And even if you're doing a non-fiction piece, make sure that we are putting our work in paragraphs so that it's not all just one long piece of writing. If you can, why not challenge yourself to include something you've learned recently? So maybe you could include apostrophes or uh, prefixes or thinking about showing the reader rather than telling. So for example, how would you show that a person is feeling a certain emotion by showing their facial expressions, what they're doing, rather than saying they're sad, you might say tears rolled down their cheek. Okay, I have got another slide just to share with you that just tells you about uploading your work to Purple Mash. It allows us as teachers to see how you're getting on with your writing. Okay, should you have forgotten how to upload purple, uh, your work to Purple Mash, Miss Coxhead has created a wonderful video, so I've included a link there. And if you've forgotten your password or email, just email the, uh, the password or the login even, email the school office and we will try our best to reply to you as soon as we can. We can't wait to see your work and I cannot wait to see what pieces you come up with. Maybe we could even share them amongst our classes as well. Good luck and I can't wait to see you tomorrow for Friday's lesson.